Right, we are facing this uh, very exciting and very interesting word problem in front of us, uh, which reads as follows. The sum of three consecutive even integers is 246. What are the integers? We solve this problem, but in a step-by-step -step fashion as follows. Right, so we let. Right, we let x be equal to the first even integer. Right, because these integers are consecutive, therefore it follows that the next one is uh, x plus 2 equals the second even integer. And uh, after this one, we add another two so that we have x plus four is uh, the third even integer. Right, so we continue to then say the sum of the, of the three consecutive even integers is 246. So now we find uh, the sum. Right, so the sum is the result after addition. So it's x plus, you have x plus 2, and we also have x plus 4. So we add x, we add the x plus 2 for the second one, and we add x plus 4 for the next one, and you understand, therefore, that the sum of these integers is 246 x plus x plus x is 3x, right? We obtain 3x plus. The 2 plus 4 is 6 equals 246, right? Plus 6 equals 246, which means 3x is equal to 246 minus uh, 6 is actually 240. Upon further examination, we divide the left by 3, and we also divide 240 by 3, and we have, therefore, that x equals 80. Right, so if x equals 80, hence the integers are given by. Hence, uh, right, the consecutive. The consecutive integers, or can I better put it as follows and say, hence uh, the three, hence uh, the three, um, consecutive, consecutive, even. Integers are given by. Right, so you have 80, you add 2, you get 82, you add another 2, you get 84. Let's do a quick check. Right, according to the quick check, if we find the summation 80 plus 82 plus 84, 80 plus 80 plus 80 is, um, is 240 and it's 246 with the uh, 20 and the 4. So 80 plus 82 plus 84 is actually 246. And we are done. Right, we have solved this problem in a step by step fashion. Um, and uh, we are excited to have solved it very successfully. And we thanks everybody for um, joining us and goodbye to you.